Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Today, my friends on the other side of the aisle are unfortunately spreading unfounded fear-mongering about gas stoves. As someone who uses a gas stove, I want to address some myths. First, the Biden administration, again, is not banning gas stoves. I repeat, the Biden administration is not banning gas stoves. The Department of Energy is not banning gas stoves. And in fact, the Department of Energy cannot ban stoves through energy efficiency standards. Instead, consistent with the law, the Department of Energy is proposing standards that would improve the efficiency of gas stoves built in the future. Mr. Delasky, to your knowledge, Will new conservation standards affect existing stoves installed in homes and businesses across America? No, it will not. Thank you. Mr. Delasky, can you describe some of the benefits related to the improved efficiency of gas stoves? The improved efficiency of gas stoves would cut bills for consumers. Um, for a gas stove owner, it's going to save them about 50 bucks. And for an electric stove owner, about $75 over the life of the stove. Those are, you know, if you saw $50 lying on the ground, you'd pick it up. And that's what the government's doing by setting the efficiency standards um, for, for gas stoves and for electric stoves, too. Thank you. Mr. Delasky, why is it important for the, for the public to have accurate information about the energy conservation and health impacts of the products they use? Consumers having information is what helps them to make good decisions um, that are best for their families. And one of the things that we accomplish with these standards is allowing people to understand what is the efficiency performance of different products in the marketplace so they can make the choices that are best for their families. While they still have, a and they will continue to have a range of choices, let's make no mistake, both electric and gas products once the standards in, is in place. Thank you so much for that. Listen, experts have long held concerns about the impact of gas stoves on human health. It is unacceptable that nearly 13% of childhood asthma is directly connected to gas stove emissions. To be clear, while the Department of Energy works to improve the efficiency of stoves, we can all take steps to reduce the potential health risks associated with their use by doing small things like turning on a vent or opening a window. As mentioned, one of the essential services of our government provides is to review consumer products and identify ways to make them cleaner, and safer. That's exactly what the Department of Energy is doing, making sure that gas stoves are less expensive to operate and produce fewer toxins and health, uh, health hazards. It is my hope that my Republican colleagues will redirect their focus to the well-being of American people rather than rather than politicizing kitchen appliances. Because you know what they are banning? Abortions. You know what they are banning? Books. You know what they won't ban? Assault weapons. But we are sitting up here talking about a ban on gas stoves. But I should be excited because if my colleagues are interested in an appliance that is causing harm to children's lives, perhaps they will get the courage to have a hearing about banning assault weapons, which are actually killing people every single day. So yes, I agree. This is dangerous and dumb. We have much better things to focus our time on. And with that, I yield back.